While I'm waiting for my first coats of my primary colors to dry, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to mix your secondary colors. When you are trying to make orange, you'll be mixing red and yellow together. For all of these colors when you're mixing, keep in mind that the darker color will be more powerful, so you don't need as much. So between red and yellow, if I need to make orange, which one is the darker of the two colors? If you squint, you can definitely tell that the red is darker. So I need less red, just a little bit of red, and then a little bit of yellow. So I'm gonna put a little bit of paint in my new paint well, clean off my brush or get a new brush, and just carefully scoop a lot more yellow until I make a nice orange. You can see I'm mixing it together. And that's a pretty good orange color. Keep in mind, we do have yellow orange and red orange that will be in between. And I have to make sure I mix enough so that I have enough for myself and my partner. And we don't want to make our paint too messy, so you might have to use different brushes and cooperate with your partner. Clean off your brush, rinse it out. And I'm gonna try to scoop this out, there we go. So there's a nice orange color, and I'm gonna paint that. Start with one layer, and you might have to go back and do a second coat. Brushing in one direction after I do the border. Then you can cover right up over your label. The nice thing about keeping your paint clear, your paint palette clean, is that I can still go back and paint my second cone of red because I kept my red nice. So make sure you're using clean brushes, rinse out your brush in your water cup, and you can use the paper towel to clean it off so that we keep our pure paint, our primary color paints, still really nice. With green, you'll be mixing a little bit of blue with a little bit of yellow. With more yellow, I should say. So a little bit of blue here brush paint off so a little bit of blue and a little bit more yellow until we have a nice green think of the Crayola green color that's what we want again remember to ooh, paint the edge first make sure it's well mixed so you don't have streaks I have a few streaks in there I'll have to make some more but getting one coat down is a good thing to do and then you can make more paint and do a second coat. Don't scrub your paper too much. I always have my brush at an angle and I'm just gently brushing it, always making sure I have a nice layer of paint on my brush. Happy painting.